My name is Anna Ogunleke. I actually joined the trust in 4th of July, 2022. I'm a health support worker. I'm actually based at MDEL Ward. The days is in Alifers. Well, the truth is that I have always had the passion for nursing ever since I started um, um, ever since I started care, working in the care sector, um, I've been opportunity to work with um, amazing nurses. And I can't forget what one of them said to me. Um, they actually said, um, called me aside and said, and I think you've got a strong drive for this part. And have you ever considered a career in nursing? And the next thing she said to me was, you should. Right, right here and then, I've just said to myself that, yes. Then, later, I joined the trust, yeah? And I can remember one time, um, Jenny was meant to come and address um, us on the teaching, doing one of our care certification training. It was actually two weeks training. So one of the days, Jenny came to address us on um, apprenticeship program, career development. And after she finished talking, I was I just whispered to myself, yes, this is it, Anna. And right here and then, I knew that the apprenticeship program is going to be an excellent start to my nursing career. I must commend, they were actually very fantastic. It was delivered excellently well. It was actually a 12 month program. That's like a year. It's um, like a once in a month, we actually go to college physically to meet with our tutor. And yes, I had the best tutor, very supportive. And I want to use this media to say to Nicola, you did well. <laughs> The truth is that I got support from everywhere. Sometimes I, I just said to myself, why is all the support coming to me? <laughs> that means this career progression that I'm doing is actually what's right for me. I got support from the, the college itself. I got support from my manager. I got support from even my ward supervisor. I remember there's this a monthly progress review meeting I do with um, the apprenticeship officer of Bansley College. It's just a review, just to check out how, what help I need, if I'm stuck anywhere, how they could help me. And also my manager, oh my God, she was so fantastic. I, I can't believe every time she just come to me and say, how is, you, how is your study going? And she said that um, if you need any help, don't, don't just relent to run to me. And even I can remember doing the point of my endpoint assessment, I was, I was juggling between studying and doing that. Um, my, my ward supervisor said to me, Anna, are you telling me what you need? Is that all you need? Like, do you want to tell me what I can do to support you in this endpoint assessment? And it, it, did, it, did, it did support me. I felt really support. I wasn't lacking anything. They are all amazing. I got a distinction. <laughs> I'm really very excited. Like, I can't express how I felt. I've said it at the start point of the program. I told my um, tutor, she asked me, she was trying to explain, that I've seen some people got distinction. I've seen some people got a pass, just depending on how um, focused you are, you're gonna get the distinction. I said to her right here and then, I'm getting the distinction. And we did. Well, it's so unfortunate that I didn't actually join the December cohort for the TNA. But yeah, I'm still looking forward to the next cohort, which is June 2024. Hopefully I start my TNA program. It's so obvious I'm, I'm, my path, my career, my drive, my passion is to become a, a nurse, a registered nurse, work in a mental health hospital. I've been an health support worker and I see that there are too many things I can do on this path. 
And that's what is my drive, actually, and my passion on the job to push further into becoming a mental health nurse. So I'm looking forward to doing my TNA, then progression, then I could top it up to become a registered nurse, hopefully in the future. Obviously, yes. I have benefited a whole lot from this apprenticeship, so yes. My answer is gonna be yes over and over again. And just, just in case you don't know, I've actually been telling people about this apprenticeship on the trust. And I can tell of some few people that are actually active doing the program right now. One is actually ending in May, so yeah. I'll do it over and over again if I had the opportunity to.